Hey everybody, iPhone you here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to jailbreak your iPhone 4S and iPad 2 running on the firmware 5.0 and 5.0.1. Now this video I'm going to make does work for Windows and Mac, and for Windows it will work on 32 and 64-bit machines. And in this video, we're going to suppose that you have no problems. Now, there is no um, 100% you know perfection on this program it is new so you might have a problem here or there but if you do I will make a video separately on how to fix the problem and how to get past that because I definitely did have problems that is why I did not make this video earlier alright so let me show you guys I just did the jailbreak and it works perfectly I have Cydia right here and it works it has you know all the packages all that so let me go to my settings I do have 5.0.1 oh sorry 5.0.1 as my firmware and for the iPad 2 this will only work on 5.0.1 now for the iPhone it will work on either 5.0 or 5.0.1 and I know I'm talking a lot so let's go ahead and get started alright so here on the computer let me go ahead and show you the program that we're going to use the program is called Absinthe and it looks like this it has like you know that green poison logo going on so basically what it asks you to do is before anything before you do anything is back up your device and I definitely recommend you to do that because I almost lost my photos thank God I think it was like some sort of glitch but I do also recommend that you manually copy and paste your pictures from your iPad or iPhone onto your computer because or else you're going to lose them also go ahead and back up now then you'll simply press the jailbreak button so let me go ahead and show you how you'll get this program now I'll have the website down below in the description and basically you're going to go to the green poison website and right here on the right we have jailbreak iOS 5.0.1 for Windows and for Mac and again for Windows this works on any machine 32 or 64 bit now um, the way you extract it might influence if it will work or not so let me go ahead and just show you how you're supposed to in this video now we're assuming I don't have WinRAR which I do but um, I don't think everyone has WinRAR so I'm just going to show you with Windows Explorer so I just opened up the program or the package I just downloaded so I'm going to go back to my downloads folder and I have tried this a bunch of times so I have the same file but here we have what we just downloaded so what you want to do is you're going to extract it and you're going to extract it to a clean folder I recommend you to make on your desktop it could be called anything just extract it to that folder so I'm just going to demonstrate I'm going to make a new folder and I don't really think it matters what it's called so we made that new folder we're going to go back to the package we just downloaded we're going to extract that to that new folder now that's what I recommend and um, I don't know if that does influence but I did read on some websites that it does so we're just going to do that and it was new folder too so make sure it doesn't have anything and we're just going to extract so here we have the new program now what you're going to do sorry what you're going to do is if you have Windows, you're going to go to your properties. Now if you have Unblock, I would just recommend you to unblock it because it also might work for you. So go ahead and do that. And I'm just going to do that right now. Okay. Then go to Compatibility. And if you have Windows Vista or Windows 7, go ahead and run it for Windows XP Service Pack 2. Now this also helps a lot because sometimes if it, if you know it shuts down it says it stopped working this might be the problem. So after you're done with that go ahead right click it and run as administrator. Alright so we're finally done with that and now we can go ahead and start the jailbreak. Now what you're going to do is again make sure you backed up everything and you're going to connect your iPad or iPhone to your computer. So that's what we have here. Alright, so what you're going to do is you're going to press the jailbreak button and it should start jailbreaking in um, a couple of seconds. But mine is not going to work because, you know, I'm already jailbroken. But what you're going to do is it's going to jailbreak and it should take about five minutes. 
but it might take a little bit more depending on how much stuff you have on your iPad. Now, I want to explain the problem I had, which I will probably uh, make a separate video on. I had a bunch of apps, like so many, and when I would jailbreak, it wouldn't work. It would like take 10 minutes and then it'll stop working, and it wouldn't even do anything. Like, I could still use it, it wouldn't change, um, you know turn black and then restore and all that. It wouldn't do any of that. So I've heard that you could restore it and I kept on thinking of you know the old-fashioned restore where it, where it would take like an hour but then I remembered we have iOS 5 and it takes one minute. It took me like one minute to restore and I had everything and I did back up from before so that might take a while but I did did back up from before and all I did was restore. Now you can restore from your computer but I recommend going to your settings then going down to reset and to erase all content and settings and then it should work from there after you erase everything and make sure you have everything backed up then you can jailbreak and I recommend that you jailbreak before you sync all of your stuff back onto your iPad or iPhone so that's what I did and it worked because I've heard that when it jailbreaks it is backing up all of your data that you have on your device so if you have a lot of apps it's going to take a really long time. So that is all for this video. I hope it helps you guys and I will make a separate one if you guys have any more questions or any more problems Well, where I will show you more details and more in depth. So. Um, stay tuned for a lot more videos on jailbreak. I have been waiting for this forever. And thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, favorite, and subscribe. Alright, bye.